What is up YouTube? Homie Smurf coming at you guys with a sneaker unboxing. And today I am unboxing a pair of shoes from Detroit Kicks. And if you don't know what Detroit Kicks is, it is a sneaker selling company. And they are based out of Detroit, obviously. But they sell 100% authentic shoes. So they say, but today we're going to get into this unboxing to see if everything checks out and is really legit. So I'm going to start off by showing you a little packet box to show that they are from Detroit Kicks and they are 100% authentic. I went ahead and removed my address so you guys ain't trying to find out where I'm at. But as you can see, Detroit, Pennsylvania, I'm pretty sure that's one of or Fleetwood, Pennsylvania, I apologize. I'm pretty sure that's where their distribution factory is, where they ship out all the shoes and whatnot. But as we open the box up, as you can tell by the box, I did go ahead and pick up a pair of Adidas Ultra Boost. And the reason I picked these up from the website was because one, they were on sale for $175. So it was already $5 off the original $180 price tag. And two, I got even more of a discount using the code SCOOP208. So if you didn't know, if you go on Detroit Kicks, try and get a pair of shoes, use the code SCOOP208 or Cash Nasty. Or I can't remember what Cash Nasty Gaming is. If you know who Cash Nasty Gaming is, he's like a YouTube video game commentator. He does 2K videos and Madden videos, so you can go check him out too. But I forgot what his code is. I think it just may be Nasty. But anyway, you can go ahead and check check out both their channels. And go ahead and show you guys what the price tag says. On the website, these were known as the Pink Dolphins. I thought they looked a little orange on, on the website, which is why I bought them, really. And because I got like 20 bucks off, they ended up costing me like 165 after tax. But... I thought they looked a little orange, and orange is my favorite color, so I went ahead and copped them. But as you can see, we have the Adidas Ultra Boost Pink Dolphin, or I, I don't know what Adidas is actually calling these, but you got a clean, sleek pair of running shoes. And I go to a college that's sponsored by Adidas, so I figured might as well get a pair of running shoes so I wouldn't stick out. Because a lot of people rock Adidas here. I didn't even think it was popular like that where I stay, but I mean, it is, I guess. And you got the pink laces on the inside. I don't know if you guys can see that. It says Ultra Boost. Everything checks out. On the bottom, it says Torsion System. You can see that. And as you can see, it has the the boost material, which is very soft. And I don't have a pair of Yeezy, so this is the closest thing for me. But yeah, like I'm, I'm really impressed with the color. I really wish it was orange, but it is what it is. And oh, the reason I didn't show you guys the the box or the uh, little postcard and the little his little business card that Scoop puts in it. Is because I actually let it fly out the window by mistake when I was on my way to Walmart. I had picked up the package right from my apartment complex, like the front office, and I had to go to Walmart. So I was killing two birds with one stone. Long story short, they flew out the window. So I apologize for that because that could have been even more proof of how um, authentic these were. But I'm going to go ahead and get into the on feet for you guys. I'll be right back. Yeah. Pull up in the bitch, got a ass up. Blowing on gas till I pass out. Told a little bitch I don't play game. I just get mine and I cash out. Money over bitches, that the way it is. Shit I ain't over till I say it is. It don't even matter what day it is. I'ma get my hand with some paper here. Bitch, I go hard from the jump. I can nail you out with the pump. What you won't do? You know I keep a stick in the trunk with a bed in there too. Shot to your face, how you looking like? Ooh, blood on your shoe, nigga, you ain't pop rule. Who the fuck is you? Nigga, on me. The one before, one before three If I was ABC's, I'd be an OG Sit your head down, nigga, learn something 
still sip a gas, nigga, burn something. I blow this shit like a trumpet, nigga. You only get gas when you pump it, nigga. The real niggas gon' fuck with me. So, after doing the on foot, I rate these comfortability wise, comfort wise. Uh, about eight and a half out of ten, these are really comfortable, but these aren't the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn. So, but everybody else was claiming that these were like the softest shoes they ever felt on their feet. They are comfortable, I will give it that. But uh, one more thing before I end the video, um, Detroit Kicks does, it's like a, it's not like Nike, so you can't have your hopes like really way up high because uh, it did take them about three and a half weeks to give me my shoes. Which now I'm not complaining because I finally got them. You know, we spend money on it. You want your stuff right away. So a little bit of impatience did follow. But uh, basically it took them a little while to get me the shoes. So if you're ordering from them, it's like a handful of people that I imagine probably run Detroit Kicks. So be patient. You will get your shoes. But if you got to go to like a birthday party or you have like a special occasion you want to get them. You want to get a pair of shoes for I would recommend to order maybe a month four to six weeks in advance maybe even eight weeks just to uh, give them time to ship your order process it get everything done so you can have your shoes in up time for your occasion whatever it may be but other than that uh, shout out to scoop 208 for the assist on this highly highly recommended Detroit kicks and I'm very happy with my purchase so thanks for that and don't forget to use this uh, code SCOOP208 to get you a discount if you end up buying from Detroit Kicks. I am, I say about 90% satisfied. The shipping time is the other 10%. But if they would have got it to me in like a week or a little less, then I have nothing but great thing to say about them. But the shipping time was a little bad. But I understand that they had a lot of orders to fill, so I'm not really going to hold that against them. As long as I got the shoes, which I did, then I'm happy. And that'll end the video. Homie Smurf signing out.